Here we see a tactical wood gas hydroelectric power system. We've got the power head here that turns the water pressure and flow into uh, 12 volts. Anderson power, power pole connector. And you unplug that if you want to take 12 volts directly. And then that goes into a 12 volt USB converter, which we take our USB out here and you see the blink in there. So you just started charging our double A's. So when I'm out in the field for 12 volts, I use a 10 end loop a nickel metal hydride uh, rechargeable batteries and I run my KX3 ham radio off of that and my Baofeng UV5R I got the uh, AA adapter for that and I run it off of that so I got really uh, up to 1500 uh, recharges which means basically I, I could run out without going to town for power for a long 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 time so the the head here, the power head, is connected to a collapsing. This goes flat for for backpacking um, because we what we needed is about 30 feet of that hose going up the stream uh, to to where it picks it up. Um, and uh, 30 foot of half inch hose is too much to carry. So we figured out a way to get flat hose that backpacks nicely and doesn't weigh very much at all. And it is uh, pretty tough. So let's go back uh, up to the top and take a look at where it's coming in. You just follow the stream as straight as you can um, to get where you're making power to be as low compared to the input as possible. You see in here, this is steep enough. You can see kind of little sections of rapids. Um, but you don't see, there's not a, it's not a whole lot of flow here. You don't need a whole lot of water to make this thing work. So up at the top, so at the bottom there, we've got two 15 foot sections of this uh, black collapsing hose. And that works with, um, if you've got a waterfall that's straight down, you can just use a single one of those guys. Oop, we've got a motorcycle coming by here. Um, and we've got uh, at the top here, uh, of, I guess a reducer. We've got the input funnel. The bag acts as the mouth. Um, what we've got up top is a wire that's inside the, uh, the, the mouth that keeps it open. We've got little parachute uh, cords that come out and hold the thing in place. So we, we receive the volume of water in here we neck it down, and then at the bottom here, we've got enough pressure to really inflate that flat hose so that it's not uh, restricting the water. So there we have it. Uh, 10 watts of power to charge your batteries up and run your ham radio station or run your uh, flashlights or anything you need for power when you're out in the field and you want to stay in the field. You don't want to go back into town. Um, that works around the clock as long as you've got uh, water. The big deal is the input here where the water goes in needs to be at least 10 feet above where you're taking power down at the bottom. So, uh, give us a shot. I bet we can uh, help you out with your remote power needs. This is Mike with Tactical Wood Gas. Thanks for watching.